All right, okay, so this lining up procedure has turned out excellent. It's actually working very, very well. There's the carrier right there. It's that tiny little dot, okay? Uh, we've lined ourselves up on not it, but an island. We need to go even further left. Come on. Yes, we're actually going to drop the landing gear now. That's fine. Auto brake is going to go on. Uh, arm reverser. We will probably need that, but that's fine. Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another Stormworks video. Today we are actually going to do something very, very interesting, and I don't think it's been done before. Um, if it works, it will be in the title and in the thumbnail, probably. Uh, if it doesn't work, then uh, we've got issues. But anyway, uh, this right here is a 747 built by Dishon... Dis... 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 Dishonescence... 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 Yes. Over there, if you guys can see it in the background, uh, there's an aircraft carrier. That's the aircraft carrier that we've tried out before, previously. Uh, and uh, we're going to try and land a 747 on an aircraft carrier. I don't know how well that's going to go, but let's try it. Okay, so we kind of have to jump inside of this thing as soon as it spawns. So I'm going to spawn it in again, and we're going to try and make it work. Yeah. Um, for some reason, it didn't disappear. Why? Why didn't it disappear? I don't know. All right, well, we'll try and use this one. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and climb all the way up the stairs. I don't know where they are. I can't remember. Are they back here? They might be back here. I, I legit can't remember. Uh, do, 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 do. No, they're not back here. Where are the stairs? Where are the Please? Hello? Where are the stairs to go up the stairs? There they are. All right, cool. Here's the stairs. Be oh, wow. I forgot how beautiful this thing was. Anyway, uh, lights can't go on right now because we need to flick breakers. I think. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and go into the flight deck. Here we go. Uh, and we are pretty much ready to go, so let's go ahead and close this. Um, there is a few things that we need to do uh, before we can actually fly, uh, and that is, you know, like starting up the entire plane. Okay, so I'm at the point now where I think I've got the APU started, so that's the uh, the power generation system thingamabobby. Now we're just gonna do this. And we're going to hope that they all spool up and that we can then take off. Okay, no idea how I did this, but one of the engines is on. Also, we are almost in the ocean because we've reversed. Anyway, none of that matters. Um, we've started one engine out of out of four. Uh, I can't, I don't know how I did it. I'm not entirely sure, but we'll get the other one started and then we'll take off. Okay, second engine is on. Yes. All right, this is perfect. Now we just do this one, and then we'll do that. I, in fact, do those two at the same time, maybe. Oh, that might be tricky. I don't know. Uh, but anyway, I think what the tricky part of this situation is going to be is actually landing a seven... What just happened? My game has, like, died or frozen? It's froze. All right, we're good. We are good. So all of the engines are on. Actually landing this thing on a, like, a small aircraft carrier is going to be insanely difficult. But we'll give it a go anyway. Okay, so we're in the captain's seat. This is good. We're going to go ahead and uh, floor it. <laughs> we're going to go ahead and floor it. Uh, release the brake. Okay. Throttle up. Throttle up a little bit. Do we have turny, turny landing gear? Yes, we do. Okay, are our control surfaces working? Yes, they are. Okie dokie. This is perfect. This is... Oh, this is good. As long as we can level ourselves or get ourselves to the runway, this is perfect. Which I think we can. Yes! Alright, throttle up to full. Come on, here we go. Here we go. Parking brake release. Alright, here we go. <gasps> we broke a landing gear, but we are in the sky. We're flying. Alright, landing gear up. Where is it? Here, there it is. Yes! We're flying it. Okay, and there's the aircraft carrier over there. It is currently docked at the oil rig station thing. Uh, and it doesn't really matter which way we come at this. We're just going to have to try and land on it anyway. Okay, so in my eyes, what I want to do, what I kind of want to do, is I want to fly as far as I can in that direction. And then we'll turn around, we'll line ourselves up, and we'll land on the carrier. I, I'm going to be honest, uh, I don't see this going too well, uh, because I don't... Did I land this before? I don't know whether I've landed this before. I have no idea. 
Um, I also took about 10 years to actually start this thing up. Alright, sorry, two hours to actually start this thing up. It didn't take that long, but still, it felt like two hours. Uh, but we're gonna try and land it on there anyway, and this, this should be fine. We've also got the issue of maybe a lag out. Having a creation like this land on a creation like that is asking for it to crash. Um, but that's why no one's gonna have done it, done this before, so, um, I guess we'll see. Also, at this point in the video, I just wanted to say, um, 70% of you guys aren't subscribed. So if you guys want to subscribe, if you guys enjoy my content, um, at least let me know. Let me know in the comments down below. I want to I wanna see what you guys say. Um, but yeah, 70% is a lot of people. Anyway, I'm not going to be the one that asks for subscribers. Ching! No, right, okay, that's weird. Uh, so yeah, we're going to go ahead and turn ourselves around here. Uh, we can still see it, so that's a good sign. That is a good sign. Uh, and we're gonna just land. How hard can this be? Alright, okay, so this lining up procedure has turned out excellent. It's actually working very, very well. There's the carrier right there, it's that tiny little dot. Okay. Uh, we've lined ourselves up on, not it, but an island. We need to go even further left, come on. Yes, we're actually gonna drop the landing gear now. That's fine. Auto brake is gonna go on. Uh, arm reverser. We will probably need that, but that's fine. Um, okay, we got trim. We got elevator trim. Um, is there anything else I need? I don't think so. Avionics, that should have probably been on a while ago. Panel lights, that should have been on too. Uh, Alright, we're good. We're good. Okay, we've lined ourselves up. We're ready. This is going to be great. Okay, so he has actually put some instructions on this. Okay, so throttle idle is 44. Do not use below 130 with any autopilot on. Okay, that's fine. Uh, two engines set 160, okay. 170 in wind. Okay, so you can run it on two engines. Um, there is also a slight issue. The control center panel thingamabobby for the, the aircraft carrier is in the way. Uh, it's obviously not meant for planes like this. Yes. Anyway, we're going to go down to 137, because apparently we're allowed to go that speed, so that's good. Um, do we have uh, flaps control anywhere? Do we have flaps? Toga, no, we don't want that. Switch control, no, 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 no. Elevator trim, not really the same thing. Cabin lights, cockpit lights, dome lights. No, we don't need any of those. Beacon lights, strobe lights, okay. Uh, oh, we're closer than I thought we were. Oh, boy. Okay. Okie dokie. Bit of a crash landing, not gonna lie. Landed. Perfect. Yes. Alright, we landed a 747. Alright, we need to extinguish the fires. Okay. We're just gonna extinguish all the engines and we're gonna turn them all off. Okay, turn all the engines off quickly. There we go. We did it! We landed on... We, we actually landed on it. Oh, perfect. I honestly thought it was going to crash as soon as we uh, got anywhere near this thing, but we are fine. We're actually fine. Right, we're going to have to shut this thing down, so uh, just turn the batteries off, maybe. There we go. I think it'll shut itself down now. Uh, so we'll leave it at that, I think. All right, let's get out of here, quickly. Turn these off. All right, let me out. Let me out of here. We're going to try and drive the aircraft carrier now, just because why not, you know? Okay, so we're just going to step outside. This is going to be fine, I think. Yep, this is okay. Uh, we did ruin the deck a little bit. Our landing gear is also very broken. Our landing gear back here is very broken too. Okay. I didn't turn the brakes on. That's actually, that that's something I didn't do. But I'm sure we'll be fine. Um, the Jeep fell in the hole a little bit. That's okay. Let's just go up the ladder and we'll be fine. Okay, so it's not often that you have a Pan Am um, air aeroplane on your deck, never mind a 747. Uh, let's just go ahead and start the engine and I guess we'll just go. Yeah, here we go. This thing is actually very stable considering it's got a massive plane on it. Not gonna lie. And it is gonna drive, it's moving. That is absolutely fantastic. Yes. Yeah, so um, as you guys can see, the way the plane came in, we uh, we might have smacked the deck right there. We, we might have hit that with our landing gear. Maybe. 
Um, and then we sort of ended up here. We smacked into the side of the tower somewhere. And we actually smacked into the ground, which didn't hit the tower. Wait, so we didn't hit the tower? That's pretty insane. Okay, good. And then we smacked into this big pole, which actually saved our lives. We didn't go in the water then, which is perfect. I mean, that is awesome. What does this look like on a night time? I don't know. There we are in a night time. Uh, the plane actually has no lights on because I turned uh, I turned that off. I turned the batteries off, so there you go. Uh, you can still hear a jet engine, and I think that's the APU. I think it continues to work, uh, which, you know, that's fair enough. That's okay. Um, but yeah, it's too dark, so let's make it normal. There we go. And then let's, uh, let's increase the wave. The waves? Here we go. Let's see how it deals with that, because I don't... I don't think it's going to deal with it very well, but it might. It might. Okay, so um, it's, it's having a few issues. It is staying afloat, which is very good. It's very good. However, I want to try one more thing, um, but that'll have to happen after the tsunami, because unfortunately, there's a tsunami coming. I'm just going to climb to the tallest bit of the ship so that we definitely, definitely, definitely don't die. I don't want to die. Uh, and I'm sure if we go all the way up here, oh, we can't. <laughs> we we just get smacked by the thing. Okay, right, hold on. This is okay. Jump off to the side, quick. Yes. All right, we are pretty high on the ship at least. Anyway, yeah. Look at us. Awesome. I can't like this is so weird how it hasn't crashed yet. The game hasn't crashed, and what we're in like this massive, massive aircraft carrier in terms of Stormworks at least. It is huge, um, and we've crashed a 747, a massive plane, into it. How both of these, like, both of these things have the capability to crash your game if they're in the game by themselves. Never mind them being in the game together, colliding, and being hit by a tsunami. This is just not something that happens. Imagine if this was multiplayer. Maybe we can do that. I, I, that's not going to happen. <laughs> that's definitely not going to happen. But yeah, here you go. This is this is currently what's going on. Um, there's a 747 on an aircraft carrier, and it's going up a tsunami. I'm gonna have to take a picture of that because this is never gonna happen again. Um, unless you guys do it, maybe. If you guys do it, then it might happen again. It would be kind of cool to land some different planes on this aircraft carrier as well. Not just this one. I'm thinking we will do that at some point too. The plane, it's just... It's just stopped. The the engine, the APU, has just stopped working. Wait, and the deck is actually going underwater this time. This didn't happen last time. Yeah, this definitely didn't happen last time. We might be losing the plane here. We might actually be losing the plane. Oh boy. Yeah, it's going. It's going. The plane might start to fly again in a second. Possibly. It's always it's always something that might happen. Here we go. Here we go, as soon as the back end of the ship lifts up, it might just go wing, <laughs> wing, and then the 747's flying again. Oh, it's underwater. Oh, I don't know how the Jeep stays on. I, I have no idea. It's flying. Oh, it is actually flying. The 747 is in the air. This is not normal. That is, oh, I'm dying. <gasps> oh, I'm on the deck. Uh, right, yep, yeah, that's almost dead. I'm almost dead. The, the aircraft carrier is still living. It's still fine. Uh, and the, the 747 just isn't. The 747 has fallen off. And I don't think it'll let go, to be totally honest with you. I don't think it'll let go of the ship. But it has fallen off. Anyway, does the Jeep still work? We're getting out of here. We're going. Come up. We're getting out of here. This is my driving. Look at how fast we go. Wow! Insane! Oh, here we go. We're actually going quite fast. Yeah! Meow. Oh, this is awesome. Uh, but anyway, uh, I think I'm going to actually finish this video here. If you guys want to check out either of these creations, let me know in the comments down below. Uh, they will be linked in the description. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye! Also, just as a quick side note, uh, the jeep, the jeep sinks. The, the jeep is, the jeep isn't a boat.